We might get a little update from Jesse today for his day. Uh, th today is day three on his diet, I think, isn't it? He started Friday. Yes. So we might get a little update on Jesse. That would be good. The DMs I'm talking about um, is just... Okay, after we posted the TikTok, I'm, I'm not sure to give context. It might be somewhere that I haven't seen it. But I'll... After we posted this TikTok, with the start of helping Jesse, 9.1 million people have watched it. And 2.9 on that one. And the DMs I'm talking about isn't bad. This isn't bad. That's not what uh, addressing them isn't doesn't mean they're bad at all. The thing is, the thing is, there are so many people that are asking for help. I have the business email that goes to AFK creators there. I am getting... I, I can show you. I will, I will just snip out so you don't see who it is from. I, I would guess that is great. So I can show you examples of what I'm getting. Okay, there's a new ones since I looked last time. There, there's so many here. And when you see TikTok... When you see TikTok, it isn't only people of older age. But it's people often really young people as well and it's everything from I'll show you I can show you some examples I just need to snip it away so you don't see who it is from like you get messages like this I really uh, I really need your help I'm 14 and weigh 94 kilos I don't really lose weight but I don't know what is a good diet and exercise make me lose weight if you can help me it would mean the world that's one. I'm just scrolling through. You have this is the. I'll just. Uh, it was just first name, but I'll just. It is. Hello, Knut. As so you are helping Jesse lose weight, I also weigh about the same as him. I was wondering if you could uh, also help me by sending me the same document you sent Jesse. I'm struggling with a fatty liver and desperate to lose weight to not lose my life. I really don't want to bother you. But this uh, would help me massively. I uh, have a different one. I, I could have showed you messages for hours. I'm going to TikTok about helping Jesse with a meal plan. Honestly, I'm the same boat as him. I know that I'm eating food that is terrible for me. However, the con... What is it, Sanne? Convenience uh, and taste of it is just something I can't seem to tell my brain not to give in to. I'm not sure if you even do this for everyone or not, but I just thought I'd reach out because I have no idea at all where to start with a proper diet, and I've reached out to countless uh, diet dietitians and nutritionists, but uh, most of them don't really answer back and are too expensive for me now. I'd love to see an answer back and I'm willing to even use this to help you out a little bit uh, if you're up for it by documenting my progress as time goes on for your channels. I kind of feel lost at the moment and I hate uh, how my body looks and anything you could give me information wise would be amazing thank you for uh, reading this uh, happy thanksgiving the thing is when i started to help jesse i did not do that because oh i want to start a fucking coaching service and get fucking rich <laughs> this dude as well i did it because i wanted to help jesse right so i have been thinking what can we do to easily share this information to more of them like I have no chance that the list goes on and on and on and on the last four days they go going into my inbox they're coming into AFK's inbox they're in the comments so I'm thinking make a series of TikToks where you go through your top 5 10 tips uh, of achieving a healthier lifestyle it doesn't have to be weight loss and it becomes somewhat universal for all these people who try uh, are begging for help that is true but my first thought was maybe a easy way so they can look at what Jesse is doing Sweden in Norway as well thank you 8 minutes ago for your prime maybe 
we can make a Discord channel or something where we send in updates what he is doing. Subscription based AP, I don't even know what an APP is. Redirect them to YouTube, easy. Yeah, there's a lot we can do. Discord are just plainly about. No, but really, you can just have a is for your phone to. Uh, is for your phone, for fuck's sake. I don't know what it is. APP in your phone. Oh, I thought an app. Make an app. I, I, since he had it big letters, I thought he was like uh, single letters. Oh my fucking god, I'm dumb. Since he wrote. My, make an. I thought it was like a short for something. Subscription based. Uh, that's That one is on me. It doesn't always work. This brain uh, fucks with me sometimes. Sorry. An app. But is there someone that can make apps? When I started this, as I said earlier on Twitch, I don't... I didn't go into this to make money in the, at least... Uh, <laughs> Let's be real. If there is money somewhere, I will take them. There is not, not about that, okay? It's not about that. If there is money, I'll take them. But the <laughs> I am not going to lie. But the thing is, I didn't go into this to start. Uh, <laughs> a fucking uh, coaching business. That's uh, that's the point. I didn't go into this to start coaching people to make money of, of that. I'll take the sponsorships that comes along. I'll take the sponsorships that go comes along, right? That, that, that's different. The brands we're using can pay for, can pay my salary. That's uh, that's better. But there, there's so much questions, so many DMs, people that needs help with. It's mostly people that are struggling with being uh, obese, overweight, to different degrees, that have no clue where they should start. So my question was earlier, what is the best way we could share, at least share the information out to everyone? And my first idea was to make a Discord channel on my Discord, where we update what Jesse is doing at times. Maybe I'll add in some extra information. Of course, we're going to produce TikToks, like uh, Mikael said, with some info and updates as well. But they, they, it, it's so limited. It's so limited because uh, oh, yeah, they can ask questions. But if you pull up this, this next try to go through 3000 comments. And uh, you will use hours just to sort out what's uh, good to uh, what is questions and uh, like a lot of them are really vague. Just can I get help? I need help. Or uh, yeah, and in between all the this is the most Norwegian accent I've ever heard. The comments there is a lot of them as well. Brainstorming how to make more money today. No, <laughs> I'm brainstorming how we could get this information out to people in a better way. That, that is mostly what we're doing. We have the campknut.gg webpage. We have um, my Discord server. Of course, we have this TikTok channel. We have... I, I see... But, but one thing I see is... Uh, if you look at Muskelbunten, he's responding to different comments. Sweetman, do you see this one? He's responding to different uh, comments by uh, making a TikTok. You have to do that on phone. But I feel like, isn't that <sighs> scuffed videos, Vegar? You're making them so much better than... I don't know. Go to confirm the... <laughs> Should we make a Discord um, channel where we share Jesse progress? Will that be the easiest thing first? Yes. Okay, we can we can make a Discord server. What should we call the Discord server? No, Discord name, uh, channel. What do we call the Discord channel? But yes, we can make a channel. What would you su suggest this channel name should be? Anyone? Jesse Progress. Yeah, but it has to be... Um, just call it Jesse Progress. Don't need to overthink. Okay, let's uh, call it Jesse Progress. So... Then we make a new channel, create channel, Jesse Progress. 
Make a te text channel, create. I'll, I can start by posting his diet. We're now making a channel on my Discord server to post his progress, where we also will share his diet plan and uh, trade what he's doing for training, everything, so we can um, share the information. Since there's so many people that is asking for help, they can at least see what he is doing. We can give some information on how to maybe take ideas from the diet plan without directly using it, because you might be way lighter than him, you might be even heavier than him, you might be doing more things, so you need more food. Like, to, to help people a little bit. So now the diet plan is posted, I will pin the message. We have the Discord channel up and going. So if so if someone wants to uh, join in, what, where can I post? I'll show some more DMs. I'm not looking to be thrown out in the public or gain attention. I'm simply here to ask for help. I'm 23, I'm 6'2 and I'm weighing about 125. I would guess it's uh, kilos. Uh, on a good day, ever since I hit my growth, uh, Spur, I've never been able to gain weight. Oh, he is light. There's also people that is, he's 125 LBS. So he's, to gain weight or muscle. Skinny shaming is a thing too. I hate being a twig. And people seeing me as one, where do I start, please, sir? There's, oh, there's also, so there's also people that need some help to gain weight. So they, they, following Jesse's progress would probably not be beneficial for, for them. Stop laughing, I feel offended, I'm 194 kilos. We're not shaming anyone here, we're just trying to, um, to see what people are struggling with. Oh, let's see, we have more DMs and just going through them. Hey Knut, uh, I am after surgery and I would love to lose weight a bit. I am 13 years old and my weight is 71 kilos. Can you make me a list of what I should do? I feel this is so... I, I get a bit sad when I see this. When I see this... Uh, DMs, it's 13 years old that is struggling with weight. My question is, where the fuck are the parents? No, Ducky, the whole point is we're not going doing this to make money at all. We're doing this. And we're, we're trying to set up so we can help them a little bit without making money that's the whole point right take his money <laughs> no but th but there's so many they're in the kitchen cooking his food <laughs> okay that was the savage comment let's see the next one hi i've just seen the tiktok of uh, you reaching out to another streamer offering online coaching to him i only came across your page there but I'm just wondering, do you do online coaching on a regular? I don't mind the price, but I do seek guidance for myself. I'm 17 years old at 90 kilos and I'm unhappy with my body weight. Hopefully you get back to me, Brandon. Let's go, Brandon. <sighs> this another young guy that is struggling with weight. Fucking savages on Twitch only saying we're doing it for money. Listen, they can watch an ad before the YouTube videos. That's where I get my money from. They don't need to empty their wallets. That's what I'm saying, right? They can. Uh, they don't need to empty their own pockets. They can just watch a two-minute ad now and then, and uh, then I can live uh, <laughs> live good. They don't. They don't get poor themselves. And we can bring the information out. Isn't that good enough? I've seen your videos helping uh, him out. You're a real one for that, Knut. Thank you. Mister commented on your TikTok video about the Jesse. Please help me too. I want to lose weight too. Please. I'm only 14 and 90 kilos. My life is ruined. I need to call my uh, morally superior friend. I need to call my morally superior friend and ask him a question. Hello? Hello. Good evening. Good evening. We're now live on TikTok and Twitch, uh, Mikael. Damn. Surprise call. What's yeah. up? 
I, I just told chat that uh, I will call my morally superior friend Mikal. Putting <laughs> <laughs> uh, me on a moral throne? <sighs> not good. Well, today I'm doing that. Okay. I, I I just need some advice here because when I'm going through we're going through the DMs here. There's I, I see I haven't even showed all the DMs yet, but there are a lot of people down to the age of thirteen and fourteen, probably from TikTok I would guess. Yeah. That is asking for it. But I I'm a bit afraid of giving advice to that young people, to be honest. Yeah, I know what you mean. Uh because uh, let's do a scenario that might be a bit extreme but let's say you're you're pushing them uh, a little bit on the doing diets and, and maybe they have some mental issues you, you never know who's the messaging right mm -hmm. and then they do something stupid to themselves let's say in absolute worst case suicide because of fat loss and my name would maybe be involved. Oh, this is the guy that helped, and they see this bodybuilder on the internet. Do you see, like, I, I'm thinking in worst, worst, worst case here. Yeah. They are young, that's for sure. Uh, but there are a lot of problems with young people as well. Uh, of course. Which clearly shows in your uh, TikTok uh, DMs and whatnot. Oh, yeah. And the question, question regarding if you should help or not that's <laughs> exactly to, to answer. uh because first and foremost uh, I, I think you asked it earlier where are the parents in all this uh yes there should, should be some kind of a system catching this but uh not everyone has such a system uh, in place uh in their respective countries no or places they live um, and, and just to add in there, let, let's say it was Louisa. It would be yeah. so much easier to help Louisa because I could go into a room, I could talk to her. How do you feel? How Do you have any problems today, right? Uh, you could catch the problems way earlier. Uh, if it, if it yeah. was any mental issues involved, in not only physical issues. And, and I would feel way better. And, and I am the parent as well, right? So you, you would have to take it. And that's your responsibility. Yes. But not all not all parents know how to handle such problems. There might be first timers as parents. They might not be uh, that well aware of how when it, uh, of stuff when it comes to nutrition. Let's uh, just say they might even have the same problem uh, with themselves. Yeah, it might <laughs> be. Uh, not far from all families eat healthy, uh, healthy, healthy food for dinner. Uh, uh, which then creates problems for their children. They eat a lot, or yeah. they eat high calorie food, and they gain a lot of weight, yeah. which creates problem for them. Um, and they, they might not even. Uh, they, let's be real. There's a lot of families around where there's no one that has a clue on about nutrition at all and what is a good amount they, they just they probably come from a home with already bad habits they mm. adapt the bad habits and they give the bad habits to uh, to their kids yeah and that's the life they know true they don't they don't know any better no uh, you can't blame them for that that's... no no of course not so as you probably saw, what I was thinking is like documenting Jesse's progress, what he is doing on a Discord. Mm. So, so, so for a grown-up man being around the same weight as him that has uh, that is struggling with obesity, n no problem looking at what he is doing, and maybe just they could straight up copy, they could adjust a little bit, and, and it will probably be beneficial for them anyway. Yeah, like you, you can't do any damage there. No, not really. He's a grown-up man who's chosen to take a to make a change in his life. Uh, yeah. Fourteen, thirteen, and twelve-year-olds should not do that. They should should be taught how to eat healthy uh, and shouldn't care that much about it. They should be, <laughs> to be honest, given good food. Uh, True. Uh, and be taught how to make proper or make oh, yeah. proper choices when it comes to health and. Uh, Oh, yeah. and, uh, and fitness 
That is correct. They they should um, they should be teached by their parents how to choose the correct or because everyone can have some unhealthy food. That's not a problem. It's more yeah. uh, when it comes to the point that it becomes a problem in, in that mm. age. So, so I'm but not sure. Maybe you can encourage the, uh, the the young people asking you to go to their homes and parents and ask, "Mom, Dad, are what we are eating now healthy?" The good, the good. Because I have to admit, I, I responded to one that was 14 year old. Because mm. he, he was Norwegian, he said, I'm a boy, 14 year old, 42.2 kilos. He wants to start training, and he was just asking for general advice. Yeah. And, and I, when I saw the message, I was thinking, I started when I was 13. That wasn't a problem. We. We were like a group of kids that was just lifting together. Uh, everything was fine. So, so the general advice I gave him is just remember this. Will you need to prepare yourself? This will be take a long time to get like real results, and so, do uh, do as much uh, or um, work on not being injured because if you're injured you can't train and that will stop the progress but it was just like basic uh, advice that this isn't this isn't any in uh, three months i want to look like uh, that guy i saw on youtube <laughs> that was the point of the advice yeah uh, but I don't, because i i don't think those children can make individual choices i think it's more important that measures that involve the child's whole family work better than measures that only focus on the child if yeah. the whole family agrees to the same rules for example no no uh, chips or uh, candy in front of the tv uh except on uh, on weekends it's much easier for the child to follow those rules uh, yeah. Uh, also, so many are depressed. Yeah, I just wanted to read infinite. Also, many are depressed and can comfort and eat comfort foods. That is for sure. Yeah. So, uh, but but uh, but it's hard to. Obviously, I can't help with them with mental issues. <laughs> Other no, than I, maybe I can improve their health a little bit by giving, so they're looking at what we're doing for for better physical health might help them a little bit mental mentally. That that might that's the only way that it can be a little bit helpful from from this side. Mm. Of, and what you should do is if you uh, face a child having those problems, you should encourage them to ask for help. Uh, of course not, not maybe not from someone in the internet but maybe from someone at school uh, and then they can uh, make sure they are sent to the right uh, right people that can help that can help them true but then again there there's not every place in the world that uh, has the has opportunity that. <laughs> absolutely not so uh where it, it's different living in norway and living maybe in a we can just go to the United States. Some places in the United States, uh, United States, uh, United States is a big place. Uh, <laughs> yeah. it, Some places. Place, place. Yeah, correct. And I, I would guess they have a little bit better for kids at school compared to grown-ups there as well. Mm. So, I think we just should be honest in just saying, I should not help you because. <laughs> Uh, it's, it's a bigger problem than uh, than uh, what you can help them with. Uh, they need face-to-face -face help, not uh, something over the internet. True. But you can push them in the right, the right direction by encouraging them to seek help. And uh, yeah, I agree with you. Motivation. I I I, that, I agree. But you mm. like me telling them to give them a let's say i can give them a start because this is often people are sitting on their asses with their phone internet just telling them to go outside and walk for an, an a half an hour every day like th that advice th this is a start but you should obviously seek more help but you can start with start with this th that that wouldn't be a bad advice either encourage them a little bit on the way just to some physical uh 
Activity. Uh, activity, yeah. Yeah. I don't think that would have been bad. No, like find a hobby, some sports, uh, go for a walk with the family or take your bike to school M- might help. Uh, yeah. uh, inst- instead of taking the bus, for example. Uh, yeah. Small things. Yes. I, I Baby think... steps. I, I think I need to, um, we need to make a document, a little document where we, uh, that I can, we can write like general advice for them for as as kids hmm. that don't you think that would be good like yeah, it's not, so. like like what we have talked about right now now just add it into text or make it into text and say look at look at this uh this is what uh, i would give you as an advice yeah and add in what you said with family mm-hmm. seeking help maybe talk to your family about uh, their habits if that is uh, that is the thing because it, it could be so much different situations yeah uh, it differs <sighs> yeah uh, and just if you're not doing anything physical start with a little bit you don't need to go insane it, it's just walking in half an hour a day as an example that it will uh, make a difference yeah, it's the small small things that really help. Yeah. Uh, and then you can evolve. Then you can evolve. Is there any web pages we could have di- directed them to with good information as well? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a good question. Because I would guess yeah, there probably is. Yeah. Hmm. Most I I would imagine that most Western countries have uh, have some sort of equivalent to uh, our Helsinki Norge, where there's a lot of information regarding this. Yeah. Uh, I would think the US, the UK, for example, has it. Let's see here. I just have to laugh because I saw a guy, the first thing he posted in chat was Andrew Tate, hustleruniversity.com slash official. <laughs> We're redirecting them to him. Maybe <laughs> 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 one of the worst places to send them at such a young age. Yeah, 13. <laughs> Knut sent me to this. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I'm chilling. The thing is also takes time it comes to weight gain and weight loss human body takes time to develop and change and you have to keep positive mindset uh, the best tip is to start to doing a routine in your everyday life to make it easier of course mm. get get the routines in that uh, you're changing your routines yeah of course that that is the most important thing so it, so the new normal for you I'm will not be in the mood for to do the healthier choices shit kids in chat that can't even speak in a normal way uh, 30 308 of it. never gym never diet no idea to start start away the question of course I, I see your point there's a lot of people who has never had this uh They've, they've never even had, uh, thought about the issue before. It maybe has gone so far that it is a bigger issue. Mm. If that makes sense. That was a bad yeah. uh, sentence, but, uh, but I think you... I know, about... I know what you mean. But it, you t- also talked a lot about it during uh, Camp Knut. Like, there was a lot of people in chat who were uh, at the same stage, not knowing where to start, what to do, how to begin. Uh... <sighs> And the usual answer from you and Wake was start, just start with something small and then yeah. make it into routine. And then you can evolve to the next step where you do something more or something else. Yeah. Uh, healthy choices, uh, like taking a walk, riding yeah. your bike to school, doing a sport, Yeah. Some, something you find fun. 
and you have to explore it. It's not nece you don't necessarily find the best alternative for you uh, at first try. Maybe you have mm. to try it, uh, several sports before you find something that's fun. Correct. Because there, uh, there's a big difference from people who just want to go in all into the gym and people who just want to live a normal life and be normal built normal weight in the middle nothing more there's two different uh, approaches to those two settings or those two goals but Knut what he saying in there is something that should be considered before the next camp making a startup thing for viewers they can so they can relate we kind of did we made like a because camp Knut was focused on of course the content and uh, we made a newbie diet plan that we posted on the webpage and we referred to that one if you want to start out with, with some explanation. It was videos for every exercise. I started 130 in April, now I'm down to 106. When it becomes a habit, it feels weird not to eat healthy and work out. Yeah. True. Lifestyle advice would make uh, for good YouTube content. I think so. The, the only problem is I'm so used to doing it on Twitch, but you can just take the Twitch streams and edit them into YouTube content as well. But then I need to make a little note. We need to have a we need to have a little note about uh, under edge and what is the keywords would be uh, talk to family. What more did we say, Michael? Talk to family. Uh. Uh, what is the family eating at home? Might better slash good healthy. I can uh, guide him in the right direction. Oh, yeah. I will probably forget this note and when I turn off the computer in a few days I will get a question do you want to save this and I will just be tired and I want to turn off the computer no that's how it is I save it now then <laughs> <laughs> lazy <laughs> it isn't only lazy it's just straight up horrible <laughs>